because you mentioned that pornography has had positive and negative effects on <laughs> society in general. I often say that pornography makes great sex entertainment, but terrible sex education, right? Like, because there are things you don't see. How do you feel that most of it? Most, yes, most of it. Most of it, but there we go again. They are not. They are not exclusive to each other either. Right. It all depends. I mean, the way I see it, porn is mass media. It has become mass media, and and unfortunately, it has become sex education. Like I, I, I was telling my story, and I said that I kind of used it in that way, mm-hmm. uh, and we all know that young people today are using porn uh, as sex education. Uh, The problem is that so many of these young people are doing it without uh, without critical tools, without a way of really thinking about it and analyzing it. Uh, but this is this is really a lack of media skills in general. Mm. That is something that we need in today's society where internet has become so widely important right. in our lives. And, and as you say, porn, uh, most people who make porn they are not making it out of the the perspective that they are making something educational. They are making it to be entertainment, but then it's becoming used in another way. And and the problem also for young people, I think, is that that if they don't have this critical thinking, they haven't had had the teachers, they haven't had adult people in their life, parents, et cetera, who have helped them to, to, to... to tell them a little about how to think about about porn in general, then uh, they obviously they go online, they watch it, and they bring it into their own lives. They reproduce right. what they have seen online, and they think that that is going to work for them. And unfortunately, that doesn't work for so many people because porn right. is a very exaggerated fiction of yeah real sex you know I sometimes I try to explain this to young people I say hey you know you've been to the cinema you know Superman can fly in a movie in reality there's no man or woman who can actually fly because that's cinema that's an illusion that's fiction 